See, I worry about losing the seasons. It's kind of, I'm a weather girl. You know, I like spring, summer, autumn, winter. And I've just noticed it's already starting to sort of melt into one. And I, I think it's one of the things that defines us here, particularly in this country. You know, it's, I like my seasons and I would hate to lose them. You see, every time a season changes, I think, oh, this is it, I love spring best. And then summer comes, and I think, I love summer best. And then autumn comes, and, I, and I'm always looking forward to that bit of change. So I don't have a favourite season. I always look forward to the next one, and it's that moment of change that I really love. Well, I've got a home near the Somerset levels, and of course last year we were absolutely devastated um, with the flooding. Um, and I just think it's going to become a thing of the future. You know, we're going to have to learn how we live with it. And, and it's difficult to see not just, you know, people's lives devastated, wildlife devastated, and really, it's, it hasn't recovered. You know, my, my home is different to it was pre-flooding. It really is, it hasn't dried out. I'm lucky to be surrounded by wildlife. I see things born, I see things grow, I see things fight for survival. Um, yesterday, I saw something very unusual, and it was a lovely thing to see, it was a badger curled up in one of my hay barns and it was a lovely thing to see but it was a worrying thing to see because badgers don't live in hay barns. That badger had to live in a hay barn because it was flooded everywhere else. It was lovely for me, it wasn't so good for the badger. For the love of my home on the Somerset levels, let's do something about climate change. Show the love, it's Valentine's Day, this is your moment. Show the love. It's Valentine's Day. This is your moment.